So x-rays are done, now I'm about to go check to the doctor's office. So wish me luck for good news. Good morning, checking in, last name Chapman. Did you get x-rays? Yes, ma'am. Checked in, you know where the waiting room is. Yes, right ma'am. Thank you so much. You. Now we wait. Now we wait to see what the doctor says. Ooh, wish me luck. Wish me luck. Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. All right, guys. So we're in here waiting for the doctor to come. This is what my foot looks like now. Let's see it with the sun. That's what my foot looks like. I think it looks like old people's feet. I don't know. So my doctor's about to come in. So about to see what he's about to say about this. And then maybe sketching the next surgery. I don't know. Stay tuned. Well, good morning, guys. It's the next day. I did not record after I got out of the doctor's office, but the doctor said that my foot isn't healing as fast as he wished it would. I'm um, still more vitamin D, um, I guess, for the bone, I guess, to get to strengthen and to heal. Um, it's healing, but it's just slow. So, also, with that, he said I can transition back to my shoe or boot where I can fit my foot in. So if something like one day it swells or something like that, I can put it back in the boot um, if it gets too much, but he wants me to start a transition um, into a shoe. So let me show you guys what we got. Look, you guys, I've got it in a boot. I got both my boots on for the first time in four months. So you just want to be sure about it. Um, so today I'm going in to get a CT scan of my foot and then I make a follow-up appointment and then go from there so you can see the healing process just to make sure it's okay. And then to talk about, hey, when do you want to go ahead and schedule the other foot to get done? Um, so again, all this has to be done before I get out the Marine Corps um, and transition, before my transition date, not my EAS date, but my terminal date. Um, and we'll talk about that more as we get closer to it. All right, you guys. Well, the next clip you'll see is the results from my follow-up from the CT scan. All right, you guys, so this is the follow-up of my foot. So we already did the x-rays, we did a CT scan. So now I'm here for the results. So I'm about to walk in here and see what the results are. And then I will come back and let you guys know. Let's go in here and see what it ought to say about this foot. Cross my fingers that it is now healed. <laughs> Mm -hmm. can call me back. Let's see. Mr. Tatton, you got this going and healing pretty well. Oh, you got it. Wish me luck. Put my mask back on. All right, guys, so I was editing the video and noticed that I did not give you updates or even discuss how physical therapy went because the video says foot surgery update and physical therapy. So I did start physical therapy. Um, I only been twice um, so far, and I go twice a week, so only one week <laughs> that I've been to physical therapy. But I'm telling you guys, from everybody who has stopped me when I had my crutches or had the um, cast on my foot and told me about the part of physical therapy, I want to let you know you are correct. Physical therapy hurts, um, and I understand they're there to help with the motion um, of the mobility of my foot. But you guys, the, the positions <laughs> and the twists, 
listen here. Nah, I'm doing it because I have to. It was up to me. That foot would be stiff, and I'll just be peg leg D walking around here. I'm telling you right now. But hey, I'm grateful that the surgery went well. I'm grateful that the physical therapy is going well as far as the two days that I went. Um, so I'm glad about that. But you guys, it just when I first got the physical therapy, uh, my physical therapy, the doctor had me um take my shoes off and just walk. So I walked. And she's like, oh, your foot looks better. The one that has been reconstructed look better than the one that's not. I said, well, I hope so. I mean, it'd be bad if it didn't. That's why you had the surgery, right? So I did that. And she had did some movements and just was pressing on my foot. And... My apologies. I couldn't hear what you said. Because I wasn't talking to you. Y'all excuse Siri. But like I said, so she was pressing on my foot. Um, turning different ways and it hurt um, but then she did say there was scar tissue on the outside of my foot that I that had to be I guess kind of like broken up um, to get the mobility into it so um, she was just telling me some of the things that we would have to do and everything so you guys I went to my first physical therapy appointment right the guy in there bless his heart you know he's working he's with the Navy and everything so he's doing the best he can Twisting my foot, telling me to do some exercises. I'm like, I can't do that. Do your toes like this. Boy, my toes haven't been moving in I don't know how many months. I can't grip nothing. And, you know, I can't grip nothing with my toes. So he's all laughing. You know, it's just me being who I am. Um, but, yeah, the motion bending my foot and everything back and all that, it was crazy. Um, he tried, but he was just doing his job. So doing stretches and everything else. So they gave him some stretches or one stretch to do at home. And, you know, I haven't been doing it. I haven't been doing it so far. Uh, but it's like, it's, we had a lot going on at home. As you guys already know, you watch if you watch the live from um, CC's World TV, you know, we're in the process of going full time. Um, so I've been busy. I've been moving a lot. Um, so that's a good thing. And I'm glad, actually, my foot haven't really been hurting um, that much. That it hurts. Let me tell you, about, it doesn't hurt while I'm in the middle of moving. But once I'm done, it's a wrap. You know, I tell all my kids, I tell family, like, hey, if we're going to do something, let's do it. Get out the way. Let's do this now cause, and let's get it done until we know we ain't doing no more. Because once I stop, there's a wrap. I'm done. The shoe coming off, the foot looks swollen. I'm, I'm done. I, I'm not moving because now I can feel all the pain. Um, But, yeah, so I'm grateful uh, for the physical therapy that we have here on base. Um, And they're doing the best they can. They're doing the work. Um, But... Well, you guys, yeah, I'm to after physical therapy. They have this heat or cold compression, and I got the cold. I'm like, I don't want no much heat on me. So I got the cold, and that thing is ice cold on my, it's my whole bottom of my legs. I felt like my legs were frozen after I got done with it. And so the next day I came back, he's like, you want some, uh, you want cold or heat compression? I said, can I get none? Because I don't want, I said, my legs, I felt like there was icicles, and I didn't tell him. I said, but I had to loosen them up because it was just too cold. I felt that, was, and I understand they're supposed to help. I guess with the swelling and, you know. But I said, oh my god, I can't take this. Um, but yeah, so I go back next week. So I thank you guys for all your prayers, um, your support through the surgery. This is one out of two. So I had the left foot surgery done. So you guys, let you know, in a couple months, I gotta get the right foot done, and. My doctor always said the worst thing is knowing what's coming that you've been through it already. You have to go through it again the second time. So we're going to be prepared for that. But other than that, family, that's the update with my foot. Um, for my left foot, I don't think I'll be doing any more updates on that because right now just physical therapy. Um, not technically downhill, but we all to a good start um, recovery-wise. And I thank God for taking me through the surgery, bringing me out. Um, no, no complications. Um, and now just getting over, you know, me doing my part. Um, he brought me this far as my, me doing my part to make sure that I'm recovering correctly. Um, cause you know, Grayson got me on, he got me out here running and, you know, Gabe, you know, trying to be testing me and everything. And then in case I need to, you know, sneak up on Sarai, you know, I, I need, I need my foot ready to go. So other than that, thank you guys for watching. <laughs> Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share with your family, share with your family and friends. And if you have also had reconstructed foot surgery, 
and have been to the physical therapy. I know the things I need to do after physical therapy is done because um, the physical therapy is not forever. So leave it down in the comments below. Like, what are you doing um, for any surgery? I guess foot surgery, you have foot surgery or reconstructive foot surgery. Like, what are you guys doing to prolong your um, mobility and just keep it, you know, just to stay on top of it? Um, cause I don't know. Cause like once I get done physical therapy, you know, it's just there foot just there. So, all right. But other than that, you guys stay, stay safe, stay blessed out there. And I'll see you guys in the next video.